Yeah, from 9 on, he's in the industrial area. Industrial area. It looks like he's on a pavement. Hello, people and sheeple. Pinaki News. Police officers like Wayne Cousins, who raped and murdered Sarah Everard, are more common in the police force than you think. But before I get to that, did you know? A leaked document revealed Met Police trainees are violent and dishonest. Now there's a surprise. And because of this document, Cressida Dick was forced to defend recruitment standards. But the leaked document speaks for itself and reveals cases of violent disorder, cheating and dishonesty amongst trainees at Britain's biggest police force. One leaked document showed that in July last year a female recruit at the Met's Hendon Police College was detained after punching and headbutting another officer while allegedly under the influence of alcohol and drugs. Other documents revealed instances of dishonesty amongst recruits weeks after the force was accused of institutional corruption following an inquiry into the unsolved murder of a private detective. Last year, Cressida Dick was forced to deny rumours that an entire intake of Hendon recruits had failed the initial selection process, but was still given a start date because the Met needed the numbers. And one of those numbers shows that in May last year a female recruit was allowed to continue with her training after being discovered cheating in relation to a knowledge retention exam known as KRE-3 then lying about her actions. And in March last year another trainee police officer admitted cheating in an MG11 assessment which measures an officer's ability to take an accurate witness statement by copying another trainee's work. So if this is the standard of recruits being allowed to join the police force, then no wonder we end up with police officers like Wayne Cousins. And here are a few more rapists, murderers, paedophiles and perverts, all once members of the police force, who are employed to help protect us from crime. 31st of July 2021, Special Constable Philip Gregory, North Wales Police, 14 sexual offences, was jailed for 19 years. 19th of August 2021, Prison Officer David Whitefield, HMP Low Newton, sexual favours from prisoners, jailed for 6 years. 22nd of June 2021, Youth Custody Officer Ashley Wright, Milton Keynes, sexual activity with a child, jailed for 2 years and 2 months. 11th of June 2021, P.C. Dal Plukinski, Humberside Police, indecent exposure on duty, fined 450 quid. 10th of June 2021, Detective Sergeant Ben McNish, Metropolitan Police, caught filming women in the shower, 20 weeks suspended sentence. 9th of May 2021, Paul Lamb, Metropolitan Police, 19 sexual offences, jailed for 17 years. 30th of April 2021, DC Mark Collins, Metropolitan Police, inciting a child for sex, jailed for 28 months. We got PC Wayne Cousins, Metropolitan Police, murder and rape of Sarah Everard, as we know, jailed for life, gonna die in prison. Sergeant Ben Lister, West Yorkshire Police, charged with rape, case still proceeding. PC Finch, Hampshire Police, gross misconduct, sexual exposure, sack. PC Andrew Sollers, Hampshire Police, sexual assault, three months suspended sentence. PC Christopher Wilson, Devon and Cornwall Police, gross misconduct, sex on duty, jailed for 10 months. Police officer, name unknown. South Yorkshire Police, gross misconduct, sex on duty, sacked. PC Brian Majid, Cheshire Police, indecent images of children, jailed for 20 months. PC Andrew Perry, PC Zoe Phillips, Went Police, Gross Misconduct, Sex on Duty, Both Resigned. Inspector Jonathan McLeod, Essex Police, Sexual Assault, Still Proceeding. PC Lee Tutton, Staffordshire Police, Child Sex Offences, Jailed for Six Months. PCSO, David Mallard, West Yorkshire Police, Inciting a Child, Sexualised Chat, Jailed for Ten Months. 
Sergeant Benjamin Nish, Metropolitan Police, Sexual Offences, Still Proceeding. WPC Gemma Dix, South Wales Police, Sex Acts While on Duty, Final Written Warning. PC Rudvale Waters, Metropolitan Police, Charged with Sexual Assault, Still Proceeding. PC Tim Bremer, Dorset Police, Charged with Murder of His Mistress, Jailed for 10 Years. Prison Officer Chloe Jones, Prison Service, Sex with a Prisoner, Jailed for 15 Months. Sergeant Michael Grigg, Hertfordshire Police, Sexual Activity with a Child, Jailed for 6 and a half Years. Ian Hales, Northumbria Police, Sex with a Victim of Crime, 18 Months Suspended Sentence. PC Derek Kennedy, Police Scotland, Downloading Child Porn, Still Awaiting Sentence. PC David Humpherson, West Midlands Police, Indecent Images, Sacked. Sergeant Ross Coleman, Northamptonshire Police, Indecent Images of Children, 12 Months Suspended Sentence. Sergeant Stephen Shaw, West Midlands Police, Indecent Images of Children, Sacked. Sergeant Shalkat Zaman, West Midlands Police, Charged with Sexual Assault, Still Proceeding. Sergeant Bruce Humpston, West Midlands Police, Sexual Harassment, Sacked. Bradley Paul Smith, North Yorkshire Police, Making Indecent Images of Children, Jailed for Four Years. Keith Farquharson, Aberdeen Police, Murdering His Wife, Jailed for Fifteen Years. PC Phil Richardson, Bedfordshire Police, Making Indecent Images of Children, Fifteen Months Suspended Sentence. PC Amjad Ditter, West Yorkshire Police, Charged with Sexual Touching, Still Proceeding. PC Abby Powell, South Wales Police, gave oral sex while on duty. She resigned. Robert Branny, Devon and Cornwall Police. Animal Pornography, jailed for 10 months. Aisha Gunn, Prison Officer, Sex with a Prisoner, jailed for 12 months. Philip Patterson, Sussex Police, Sex with a 13-year-old boy, jailed for 6 years. PC Ben Robinson. West Yorkshire Police had sex with a victim of violence, nine months suspended sentence. PC Derek Seekings, Surrey Police, charged with seven rapes, 11 years in prison. PC David Waller, Cleveland Police, rape and sexual assault of a child, 12 years in prison. Now trust me when I say this list goes on and on and on, going back years and years and years. And I've only just listed the sexual offences. So, people... Our police force is full of criminals, and new ones are being recruited daily. That's gone right, right, right at the end there. Put that camera down, or we will tase you.